one in the comments that's cool. That's right. That's all right. We don't pay attention to the haters. Nope. Positivity. Mother's Day. Uh, shout out to all the moms. So what are you doing for Mother's Day? I mean, so you have to have like a fucking um, a Zoom dinner with your other mom friends, right? Well, like we're currently in Ramadan right now, so everyone's fasting. Oh, that's true. So yeah, um, so maybe like me and my mom will do like a big dinner, like an extra dinner, you know, for fasting. Oh, she's and into like cooking. Hmm? She's in Toronto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The whole family, even your dad too. Yeah. Well, no, my dad, that's Italian. He's in Italy. Okay. So he's okay out there, though. You know, they had it rough over there with Corona, but he's good over there. And um, yeah, she's here. So maybe we'll just have an extra feast because by the time I break fast, I'm so tired. You know, we clean, cook, and all that. And then I just want to sleep because I just ate so much food from breaking my fast. So being a Muslim woman, will you give a Christian some dick or not really? <laughs> nah. No. No. Oh my god, I have to change religions. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, we can't talk this talk. It's Ramadan right now. All right. It's Ramadan. It's, okay, it's Ramadan. It's Ramadan. Right, well, uh, kiss, your, kiss your child for me and then Thank uh, you. You too. All right. I'll kiss see you. Kiss your for me too. I am right, take you. care. You miss me? You too. Of course I do, man. Always. Stop crying. I'll be there soon. <laughs> bye -bye. All right, man. Take care, man. Bye -bye. What's the problem? Is there a problem? What? What you need guys looking at? What? 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 It's a free country. Say what the fuck you want. Okay? All right? Just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. She was pretty. God. No matter how pretty they are, they'll find something to say. Always. Always find something. I pull people together, okay? Just shut the fuck up, okay? Hey, Monique. Hello? Okay, bye-bye. She's just a regular on my show. She is a regular, I'm sure. Oh no, you called me. Uh oh, I'm on. Wait, where's my remote? Hey. Hey. Miss Boston Oil, how you doing? <laughs> I'm good. Hi. So she was on Tory Lanes twerking. They call her Boston Oil. Because she had that natural ass and she poured oil on it. Last time she was on my live, her boyfriend was getting high and she was twerking for all of us. So you remember me, huh? You're just giving like a whole summary of everything, huh? And she's Haitian. Ça passe wa boule. <laughs> Who taught you that? Where's your, where's your boyfriend at tonight? Is he getting high again? No, he's not. He, he's next to you? Yeah. <laughs> She's like, yeah. <laughs> is your period on or he's in your ass right now as we speak? <laughs> he's actually putting pillows on him just in case the camera slip because he's naked. Yeah, we don't want to see him. I got enough dick. <laughs> What's in your on this... head? Is that like a scarf or like a thing? It's a t-shirt. Is it like a underwear? I feel like been looking like Pharaoh tonight. Wow. Let my people go. Okay, King Pharaoh. I'm King Pharaoh. <laughs> Let them niggas go. <laughs> Hi, I've been watching you for the past hour. I've been multitasking, though, watching you and watching 911. 911 what? It's a show called 911. On what? What network? Is it cable network? No, I'm watching it on Amazon. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It's lit. Got me crying all day. Why? Why are you crying? Because it's so emotional. Like, it just be getting to me. Is it like a documentary or is it it's like a series? It's like a series. It's about, like, firefighters, police officers, saving people, falling in love, stuff like that. There was some it's people just so 
They were looking for you to be twerking. You ever twerking off? You having a sweatsuit tonight? Uh, I was I was um uh, twerking on my personal page, and then I was like dr uh putting water on my body, and then I was sweating, and then I got cold, so I put the sweater. <laughs> it's not like you're just making Corona, nigga. <laughs> I wasn't making Corona. <laughs> I got cold, and then you know I. What you have on that? What you have? A, what you have? A sweatpants? We have one. No, I have a booty. Wait, let me see. I got like a booty short on, and this. Tell that nigga to put some shoes on. <laughs> Take your leg up, and nobody wants to see your toes. No one wants to see your toes. <laughs> He's on the couch. Why would he put shoes on? Do, do you wear shoes on the couch? That's an ugly motherfucker. He's got that fucked up feet. He got feet like Shaq. <laughs> like killing it. You coming for your feet, babe? <laughs> you got feet like. He got two you left. Say? Tell that nigga he has two left feet. <laughs> got two left feet. <laughs> They're coming for your feet. Bro, when you get dressed to dance later on tonight, let me know. Huh? Maybe you get get comfortable clothes so you could, you know. These are they can't, comfortable clothes. They can't. They don't want to see that sweat shirt. They want to see Boston oil. Oh my! Actually, you know, actually, I was using it. Look, it was right there. Good. Can you put Jamaican can you it again? black castor oil? You know, I was on Twitter. I was reading the Twitter comments, and somebody said. You use all that oil on your ass. What you gonna put on your hair, sis? And I was like, shit, for real. <laughs> it's Corona. The hair stores are closed. What am I gonna put on my fro? <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, wait. I'm not wearing a, a moo moo. I'm actually wearing booty shorts. See. I'm sure you wearing booty. Yeah. I'm not yeah. cool. I'm just yeah, getting comfortable. It's Sunday, Saturday night, and the internet is driving me crazy. It is. Everybody, yeah, everybody. I want, I want you to dance to my, my guy's song, all right? His name is Fire Mike. Hold on, let me see. Who? It's, a, it's kind of like a slow song. Hold on. You Take really that want to dance right now? You don't feel like dancing? I've been dancing all day. You should save your energy for me and Tory Lanez. You can be dancing for your 30 followers. You wait for us. <laughs> yeah. to I know. I'm, I'm getting ready for Tory Lanez next uh, next live, though. But I didn't know you were going to come in tonight. Because today's not Thursday. Today is Saturday. You do twerking Thursday, don't you? Every Right, I know. Okay. Yeah, but today is Saturday. I didn't think you were going to be. It was last Saturday you were just in bed talking about. Where were you at? Stuff. You didn't twerk me this Thursday. Where were you? Oh, I didn't notice you were on live. Yes. And then you know what? Well, I need to I need to schedule time and promote it. You know that way <laughs> everybody could be on time. Yeah, I heard you doing like a Mother's Day thing. But I that yeah, was but be live last time. He put it on his story and then he took it off like an hour later. No, no, but what I'm doing is like my twerk is gonna be at my house and we're gonna be they're gonna be going against somebody else's twerkers at their house. Oh, I saw it last time. There was like girl, yeah. girls from your house and girls from and then, this dude's house on the couch yeah. or something. Yeah, yeah, something like oh. that. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be watching. All right, that's tomorrow, okay, baby? Tell okay. your boyfriend to wash his fucking feet. She's dirty <laughs> as fuck. Oh, I, he just, we hate that nigga. Tell him we hate his foot. He got his foot look like hands. Yeah, I got hands feet. Ethiopian queen. What up, Pooh? Hey. How are you? I'm good, just home. Playing my dick and ball. What's going on? You Who you with? His mother said. Is your mother with you? Huh? Are you with your mother? No, I am. No, I'm the only mother in the group. Oh. Oh, I have my best friend with me, but I don't think she's with me. So. How old is your children? I'm with my girlfriends. How old are your kids? You have kids? How many kids do you have? No, I have one. She's 12. Oh, she's grown. 
He's grown. He's a boy. Yeah, okay. I would take a shot of that. Shot of what? So just being a bunch of girls in the house, what y'all doing? Yeah, I can't show you faces. I can't show you faces. It's my best friend's birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh yeah, all, yeah, they're all Ethiopians or somebody from different countries. We have two Liberians, one Nigerian. Where, no, where's the Liberian? Four Liberians. I say two Liberians. Put the damn Liberian girl on the phone right now. Put the Liberian girl on the damn phone. Okay, yeah. Put the Liberian girl on the damn. Put the Liberian girl. The birthday girl. You the girl Liberian? We say. Go in your we press. Said. Give me two pounds and from your press right now. What you say? Go in your press and give me two pankana. Pankana, pankana, thank you. <laughs> you got no pankana in the damn bag there, you yeah, get it? Uh, that butter beer you eat. Can you make some, some, um, some, uh, uh, some, um, Cassava, little baggy. I, I want a baggy and I want some plow, so. Oh, you want plow, so. You see, oh, yo, both of y'all did the same fucking shit. What both of y'all did that. Did what? What, what would you want? My, my, Michael, y'all both did the same thing. I can give it, I can, I, I can do some baguette because I am from Lofa and I can do some real bar. Uh, Anything else, I don't know about it. I'm going to make it for you. If, hey, my people, you are, are hungry. Where y'all living at? What, what city are y'all in? Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, my God. How can I forget you in Atlanta? Come on, Ethiopian, Liberian, Nigerian next to me. How you been? All right, you been good? Alhamdulillah, I'm good. How was that? Uh, are you fasting? Uh, no, I'm not fasting, no. I know the names, I don't ever. I have to no, I, I saw, just uh, can you turn it down real quick? Uh, give me a second, I got you. So, I saw a post that you didn't do, like, you didn't, um... You posted something post about there, like make a caption to this, the last post that you did. What do you mean? What I, you posted something, make a caption, I like, I do some for you, something like that. You were talking about to, for someone to make a caption to your last post. I don't remember that. No, nah, no, nah, it wasn't my last post. It was a post of the guy painting my picture or something. Yeah, 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 exactly. Oh, I said, I said, what was missing to make it perfect? You know what I wanted to say? What? A white girl. Why? Because you're always with a white girl. I need you to find a beautiful African woman. Do you have one in the, in the house for me? Yes. Did you see my girlfriends? I have Liberian. I have Nigerian girlfriends. Can I have? Can I have three of them? That's a lie. Can you afford them? That's the question. Yes, I could afford That's them. The price. That's a lie. It will never happen. You see how selfish they are? You see how selfish they are? Now you understand why we go find a white woman, right? Because they're easier. Because they're easier. Go ahead and get them. Because they're easy to get to. She's not recording me. I don't sound like that. I don't sound like that. When I said what I know. But um, that's a different step right there. That's why. Bye. You the gas. You the gas. You don't want to share me, eh? I know you're talking to me. I want to talk about Brent, get it. Uh, what happened to that? Why you want to share me? Oh? We don't I share you. Yes, stop it. Share me. My so people. you share everybody? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You don't share. No, you share? Yash, I'm a king. Kings, you got to share. I find. Oh, Tom, oh. first of all, every oh. Liberian president. You're yeah, a queen. They're queens, boo. Every Liberian president had like a wife and like five, six girlfriends across the country. And Nigerian people don't? And Nigerian, Ethiopian, Ethiopian. Exactly. So all our leaders, all our leaders in Africa had a lot of women. But hold on. Let me, hold on. Let me say something. Let me say something. Even if. Whatever the, the the president or whoever you wanna you wanna say has five ten different girlfriends whatever the situation is, his wife is still number one. Akur. Get that shit his together. His wife is still number one, bitch. I don't give a fuck what yeah. you do outside the house. At the end of the day, you gonna come home to me. You gonna be scared like us. Uh, no, it's not even about it. It's not even about, about it. It's not even 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 about it
See, too much argument in the house. Too much argument. Too much argument. My people, they like brand women arguing with me. Oh, arguing with me won't be number one right away. You have to wait your turn to be number one. You start at number seven. You work your way up. Oh, all right. See, all that argument. I don't have the energy for that. We, we are not doing this. We are not gonna do this tonight. I'm not arguing with you tonight. Nope. Your wife is always number one. Yes. I already have a number one. You'll be number 10. Hi. Hold on. Let me. Oh, shit. Can you see me? Can you hear me? Yes, I hear you and I see you. Okay. What are you doing? That was. Mm -hmm. I'm good. I'm doing good. How are you? Nice to meet yeah. you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Let's see if I have any cute filters. Oh, I don't. Oh, maybe this one. You don't need it. You just... That was very much all that argument I just had with them. Yeah. I thought that... I was, like, here laughing, like, because I thought it was funny because she was like, oh, I don't care what you do outside of the house. I'm your wife. I'm your main one. But, like, we all know that we do trip about what you do outside of the house. Like, who's going to deny that? <laughs> like... <laughs> you and my... If I was your man, you wouldn't mind me having a couple of girls, right? I mean, if that's how we start it, then it's fine. Exactly. That's you know? how we start it. Right. You can't but just... if I expect you to be my husband mm -hmm. and I expect you to be just mine and you expect that from me, then no. Right. But if that's how we start, no. That's why you got to start off early the right way. Like, tell them, hey, mm -hmm. this is what I want. And that's that. Yes. I agree with you. They were going crazy, though. I was like, I was here laughing. Like... <laughs> That's that crazy. So Your titty look nice. Oh, thanks. I mean, I don't really got much on, but I'll show you my body real quick. I want, oh, my goodness. You know what? <laughs> look at those tattoos. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. I have a bird. Let me uh, see that bird. bird. Ah, I wish I was that bird right now. I would know exactly <laughs> where to fly to. <laughs> He's just chilling, you know. <laughs> are you in the West Coast or East Coast? Where are you? East uh, Coast in New York. Uh, I think we talked about this. You in Jersey? I'm in New Jersey, but I don't think I've ever spoke to you before. Oh, well, really? Damn, that bird. Maybe that bird was just on somebody else's body. Or it flew away. Before it got to you, it flew somewhere, and I seen that bird in Jersey. <laughs> yeah, definitely it's the bird. Someone said she was on Tory Lanez. Yeah, I was on Tory Lanez Live, but, like, the first time he did it. Ah, oh, okay. Maybe I decided to remember the bird. Maybe you saw there, yeah. Um... So do you, yeah. do you have an OnlyFans page? You... Yeah, of course. I have an OnlyFans, guys. Look at that body. <laughs> what about 20%? I didn't hear that. Top 1%. What's top 1%? What that means? So, like, the OnlyFans pages, how they do is based on your income. Uh, like, however much you make, you get ranked. And there's, like, all the girls in the world get ranked. And I'm in the top 1%. So 99 other percent of girls, I do better than them. But there are girls, like, better than me. Like, Tucci, she's in the top, like, 0.01%, you exactly. know? But, too, yeah, Tucci's, like, one of the highest grosser. I think she makes Yeah, I, I, Yeah, she's, I mean, she's amazing. She's Tucci, like, you know. <laughs> what so. does yours cost a month? Um, I think it's normally, like, 19.99, like, 20. But I, I always have some type of promotion. I think right now it's, like, 14 or 15. And what order do um, they get? Do they get everything? Yeah, like, I mean, so I do, like, l like sex tapes and stuff, like, you know, home sex tapes and stuff. Those I sell, but all my, like, alone stuff is right on my wall. Like, naked pictures, naked videos, right there as soon as you sign up. But, like, those extra, like, sex tapes and stuff, like, those do cost extra. <laughs> so do you usually have, like, a, do you fuck a tour? Or you ever, have you had, like, a real person fuck you on your live, on your um thing before? Um, like, what do you mean? Like a real person? Fuck like me? a human being. Fuck you on your thing, on your live, on your, um, not your live. Maybe like on your, on your only fan page. Cause yeah, I know you guys. There's actually one specific guy that I make pretty much videos with every week. <laughs> oh, wow. What a lucky motherfucker. What? Nothing. I said, what a lucky motherfucker. 
Oh, well, well, thank you. You know, if you, you know, if I want to make a video. Although you have a, don't you have a girlfriend? Because I don't even want to come in here talking shit, like being yeah, I have a girlfriend. My, she's watching right now. She's not talking crazy. She's not. She's okay, not okay. Yeah. No disrespect. I, I No disrespect. <laughs> right, don't worry about her. She's, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, well, if, honestly, that guy, if that guy, if that guy dies, let me know, okay? If he dies, like if he's on his way to you and you, a, a truck just run him over, and his I need dick a is video. not, no, yeah, you have to get the video done. Just let me know. Yeah, um, I'm looking for a girl right now. I've been wanting to do a girl and girl video for a while, and I just it's like you can't find one. I mean, there are girls, but like not any around here at least. So not really. I haven't I haven't done a video with a girl yet. I really want to. Well, just take a trip somewhere else, maybe Miami or Los Angeles. Or... Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. You, did you remember when Jasmine was in here? That's my girl, and she's in L.A., so now I want to go so bad. Jasmine, Jasmine. Jasmine, duh, or whatever. I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you friends with Jasmine? I mean, we just met the other day, but, like, online, but I love her, so, like, she's great. Yeah, she's real cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she lives yeah. in L.A. Uh-huh. Yeah. We should go do uh. stuff with her. Yeah, that would be cool. I don't know if she does girl and girl stuff. Probably. Oh, no, she no. seems you like what she don't. She says she don't. But she'll oh, probably. Right. She... My thing. She wants to make some more money. She's gonna have to do that because that's what real fans want to see. Yeah, a lot of guys ask for that. That's a really requested thing. They like that. I even like that when I when I'm watching porn. Like sometimes I'll literally type girl and girl. I love that shit. It's so hot. It turns me on. Like. Would you like to know. give or are you more of a receiver? No, oh, with girls, mm -hmm. oh, I'm like six nine type thing, like okay, pussy in my face, time. pussy in your face, cause I like dick. Like at the end of the day, I love dick. Like <laughs> any type of dick, like does it matter whether the color of the dick or no? No, color doesn't matter, but and honestly, neither does size. But just like not, I don't want the dick attached to someone that's like a piece of shit. Like I like like people who have good personalities. You know, people who can make me laugh. Like those are people like. I'm the most attractive Make you laugh too. with a big dick. Yeah, I mean, I guess. <laughs> nice lips. Yeah, you know, I mean, you gotta have those pink lips. Pink robe. Yeah, <laughs> pink Versace robe. Versace <laughs> robe, not just pink robe. Yeah. Right, well, maybe I'll try to see if I get permission from my girl. And then if you want to just borrow my dick accidentally, just let me know. Just an accident. Okay, well, I'm going to show my... Oh my it's like it's some followers. No, I'm yeah, like... everybody go. I'm about to subscribe and beat my Oh my god! <laughs> oh my gosh! Cool. Well, I'm glad you finally added me. I tried to come in the other day, but you know, you had like so many but girls. But so... about it, your picture and all that stuff looks like it's one of them guys playing games with me. You know. I know. I've been told that before. What should I make my photo? I don't want to do just a face no, no. picture. I'm not... No, no. I mean it's. The picture you got is attractive. It's perfect. It just, you know, when I'm picking them, I'm like, this one just looks so like it's a guy put this together. So that's what it is. <laughs> but you know what? Maybe I'll follow you that way I know for a fact who you are, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. That would be so cool because then you'll know because it'll show you that I'm requesting. Yes. Oh, well, if you do follow me, thank you so much. That's awesome. I love you. I saw you on Dr. Miami's live for the first time. I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, that's my homie. Yeah, he's cool. He's awesome. Yeah, he is, man. All right, well, just just send me samples. That way I know what I've been paying for every month, okay? Yeah, I got you. You got for me? For you and your girlfriend. Yes, yeah. Ryder, Ryder's watching. Ryder, Ryder's watching. Ryder, pictures are on the way for us. Me and Huck will examine your pictures together. Yes, perfect. <laughs> All right, nice talking to you. Mwah, thank you. Bye bye. You're welcome. <laughs> bye bye. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All Miss Fancy underscore bucket list. What's happening? Hey! What's up, Mike? You have not been quarantining. Uh -oh. I am. Look, I'm 
myself quarantine. Because you ain't been home by yourself for two months. You been. That's why I ain't been here. Bye. I am you have home not alone. Been. Mike, for how many hours? For, for the, the last hour. For the next five days. After the quarantine over, we're going to do that. Um, that trip. Okay. We're going to do it. It was kind of good thing it didn't happen because look at all this bullshit. Look at her. She's about to turn up. Go. Show her, Regina. Work it. Hey. <laughs> Michael Bassett, like, boo, they turn around. Hey. I'm in San Diego. <laughs> uh, are y'all both, both mothers? Huh? Is she a mother also? Oh, yeah. Happy Mother's Day. It was her daughter's birthday. We had a drive-by graduation. Oh, nice. All right. I'll see you when quarantine is over. All right, folks. Take care. All okay, right. You too. Bye. She's a travel agent. So we're supposed to put a cruise together, like a comedy cruise. And then Corona fucked everything up. So, but hopefully it's going to happen very soon. Just get your money together, fellas. It's going to be a comedy cruise coming very soon, starring me. It's going to fly from, like, Fort Lauderdale to, like, Bahamas or something. All right? Let's see what happens after Corona. Corona. Ah, right, man. Who's watching? Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. D Hawk. Where are the ladies still? Uh, trying to find the ladies. Which one I want to pick? Bro, first of all, bro, tell me this, bro. What is on your head, bro? What is on your head, bro? Tell me that, bro. <laughs> tell me what's on your head, bro. I got a 12-year-old dyke. Fuck out of here, my nigga. I'm a savage. Jesse, Busey, Sensei, yeah. Silly, Pepe, Sensei, yeah. Y'all saw what just happened? Hello. 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 How you doing? I'm fine. Where are you? I'm in my house, in my bedroom. What country? Ah, um, Spain. Oh, you're in Spain? Yes. Oh, nice. Um, I see you. Uh, uh, social distancing going on in math. What's who you with? Are you a mother? No, I'm with my child. Okay, happy Mother's Day. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. I wasn't really expecting your call. Oh, yes. <laughs> no, are you Nigerian? I, what are you from? What country? I'm a Nigerian. Oh, nice. Yeah, you like Spain? You like Spain? Yeah, Spain is good. What do you do there? You work? Yeah, I'm a nanny. Oh, okay. What kind of family is it? A good family? Yeah, they are good. But the, the, the children do come to my house. There's, oh, you're at your house right now? Yeah, I have two kids in my house. Uh, are they sleeping or they're up? They are sleeping. What time is it in Spain? Um, 8, 17. 7, 7, 8, 17 8, 17 a.m.? 8, 17 a.m.? Uh, a.m., yes. Okay, nice. Okay, nice. What, yeah. are you wearing, what are you wearing tonight? What are you wearing? What do you have on? What am I wearing? Yes. I'm wearing PJs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on PJs. <laughs> yeah. I actually want to share a story. You want to share a story? Yeah. Okay, let me hear. Okay. So, um, where should I start from? Okay. I was 15 years old when I left my family to Europe. So I traveled by land. 
and um, the journey was you travel by land to, from Nigeria. Yeah. How? By by land, bus, trekking, running, and um, finally, I I used the um, boat. I entered with um, Zodiac. You know Zodiac? What's Zodiac? Lampa Lampa. They call it Lampa Lampa. <laughs> what is it? Uh, you know, it's true Morocco, Maroc. All right, okay, okay. Yeah. So uh, I left my parents and um, my mom gave me her special wrapper. You know rapper? Are right, you from you Nigeria? Run, you tie around your waist, right? Yeah, a rapper, okay. yes. Right. So uh, she gave it to me. So as in, it was her best rapper. So she gave it to me while I traveled along um, by land. So when I got to uh, Duruku, I passed through Agadez, Koni. I got to Libya. Mm -hmm. Then from Libya to Morocco, mm -hmm. I got to Magnaya. Then there, I had my baby. I have a child. At 15 years old? At 17. Then I was 17 when I had my baby. Okay. Well, yeah. Who, who's the father? virus stops everything will fall in place again so young girls they shouldn't feel maybe guys um hope on anybody they can make it by themselves because i was 15 when i left my my parents and they didn't know where i was until i got to libya before i called them As you came, we came on on HBO. Had like Omar Epps, you know. It's, it's about it was actually what happened in Ghana. How these mm -hmm. like, how these teenage boys snuck on a boat. You know, the boat that brings stuff to like the port. They snuck mm -hmm. on a boat because what happened? They paid people, and people sneak mm -hmm. them on a boat, and it was a high. Yeah.
I have to do something for my family, you know. I have to do something. And I believe I will, I will make it. I just had the belief that I was going to make it. That's just it. No, no, it reminds me of my, my guy. My, I end up meeting this guy, becoming friends with him, and how he was able to make it through this boat, pay his way through it. You know, yeah. he paid way through it, got into this to country, you know, found a way to find some kind of job and find a way to and I and I applaud you and I wish you all the best. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And I'm really happy to share it here with you. <laughs> no, no, no. We really, really appreciate it because sometimes mm -hmm. people don't know what a lot of foreigners mm -hmm. go through. Yeah. Know? Not just, you know, from Africa, just even um, luckily like Mexico. It, people, it, we live At the end of the day, we all want a better life to come yeah. out and help our family, you know, and and we take those chances. I mean, look how many Mexicans pay people mm -hmm. to try to come across the board. It happens all the time, you know, and there's some brave people out there. So I definitely commend you for being that yeah. brave and a woman 15 years old. So yeah. how long it took you? So it took you like two years to get there? Day. so we had to move enter like just go so the water started carrying us inside and going and going and going we got to a place whereby we had to make calls for rescue we called rescue for like 10 hours no rescue so we stayed in the water for a day a day and a day we saw ships
research paper and enrolled me in school. I schooled here and my daughter has her own document too. So Biko, please don't say I'm running my mouth. I'm just trying to share my my life story because I want other people to learn and know that everybody life is not easy. Yeah. If you see three square me a day, does not does not mean other people have the same thing. I left home because we didn't have three square me. So that was really brave of you, and it's so crazy. It's like, you know, they don't they don't understand these. You know, like in Africa, like we have, there's no majority of America is middle class, but Africa is like either you're very rich or you have nothing, yeah. and those yeah. who nothing have to find ways, you know, and some just take chances in life, you know, and that was a chance that she took to make life better for her and her family. Yeah. Now, every, now you could go. You, have you been back to Nigeria? Yes, I've been. And now you get to go to Nigeria the right way. Get on a plane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, I got on the plane, and my first experience to Nigeria was good. <laughs> it was my first time of traveling on air, and my first time of seeing plane. That was 2006. I'm a nanny. Uh, I take nanny care of them. Oh, that's your only child. Yeah, this is my only child. Oh, okay. Are the other two are the white children? Yes, they are white okay, children. They're Spanish. They're Spain. Okay, good. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Keep in touch, okay? All right, sure. All right. Thank then, you. Um, just uh, send me a DM, all right? So I have your information, okay? So okay, you I will. We have to definitely make a movie out of this. So, you know, all right? <laughs> Really? I, I yeah, want your life to story is a movie. Uh, really? I think the world the world needs to know about it. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah. I I will be happy to share. I will be very, very happy to share. Okay. It was a pleasure talking to you. All right. I should DM you now, right? Yeah, DM me now. Okay. Right, what will I say? <laughs> like just, yo, just um because I guess so many of them shucks. What should yeah, that start with? What is it? What it starts with? Flugzi. F L O Z I. Okay. Hold on one second. Okay. F L O Z I. Z. Yeah. Okay. I underscore. N E O N O S O. Okay, okay. Flozy Nosa? Yes, that's me. All right, I just followed you, okay? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you too, and I love you. Bye. Love you too. Bye bye. Bye. I was trying to say booty, and then no, it's this story. That was amazing, right? Ah, she she don't need no cash app. Anymore. She just want to share her story. She has a job. She's fine. She don't need no money. She has a very interesting story that needs to be developed into something. You know, it's it's just crazy what black people have to go through. Not just black people in America, we guys are going through with the racism, but what Africans have to go through. 
across the world, you know. Look how they got treated in China. You know, they just, like I told you about that one story about the movie called Deadly Voyage, which is a true story about four friends, teenage boys, pay their way through getting on a boat. And then I guess even when they, they got caught on the boat, they hit in a boat because the news going high for like, I mean, those boat trips from Africa to the States has to be every bit of a month, three weeks. So they're supposed to like hide in a boat for that long and eat and survive without nobody knowing they're on a boat. That's tough, man. Things that we go through just to get a better life for our family. Sometimes we lose our life doing it. You know, just just be grateful for every everything you have. Any every be happy for everything that God gave you. You know. Because life is not promised to you. I mean look, look at Kobe. I hate to bring that memory. Look at Kobe. Look how he lost his life. You know, so we we bitch all the time about the wrong shit. We bitch all the time. But just be waking up in the morning and breathing and having food to eat, it's a blessing. Because everybody don't have that. Some people didn't wake up today. Some people are not going to wake up tomorrow. All right? So just remember that. You have a lot to be thankful for. I don't even feel like putting on no more twerkers for tonight. I can't go white looking at no booty after no shit like this. Very strong woman. Gosh. I never knew girls did that. I knew all this, those, you know, 16, 17 year old Ghana boys or Nigerian boys try to find a way to a better, a better world. And trust me, most of them don't make it. I hear about it all the time. So those who are fortunate enough to travel abroad, fortunate enough to just, yeah. Horrible. All right. Well, just be thankful for everything. All right. Let me just cry and beat my dick to sleep.